big cook, little cook. Welcome to our cafe. Big cook, little cook, want you to come and play. Hello, welcome to our cafe, the best cafe in the world. <laughs> What's that noise? Oh. 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 Hello, everyone. Do you know what this is? It's an old rug. No, Small, this isn't an old rug. Are you sure, Ben? It looks like an old rug to me. No, Little Cook Small, this is a magic carpet. Woohoo! It's a magic flying carpet all the way from Persia, a country far, far away. And I'm going to fly on my magic carpet just like you fly on your wooden spoon, little cook. <laughs> Are you sure it's a magic carpet, Ben? You watch. Here we go. <clears throat> go carpet, go carpet, whiz away. I wonder what we'll see today. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Shall I see who the customer is, Ben? Or do you want to fly to the hatch on your magic carpet? <laughs> oh, oh, um, uh, could you go, little cook? I, I think I need a bit more practice. I'm on my way! Woohoo! <laughs> Who's our customer today, Small? Oh, I'll give you a clue. He's young and handsome. Oh, like me then, Small. Young and handsome. And he has a magic lamp. Wow, a magic lamp. Oh, that's amazing. But I still don't know who it is. Give me another clue. He flew here all the way from Persia. Persia? <gasps> Persia? That's where my magic carpet's from, Small. Does he have a magic carpet too? Yes, and he flew here on it. Oh, I know! I know! It's Aladdin! Oh, and he's come a very long way. We'll have to make him something extra special. But what can we cook for a boy with a magic carpet? I think it's time to look in my book. We need a story to help us cook. Let's take a look in Little Cook's book. Little Cook's Adventures in the Big World. Let me see. There was once a poor boy called Aladdin who lived in Persia. One day, Aladdin saw the Princess of Persia and fell in love with her. He was so sad, though, because she would never want to marry such a poor boy. But when Aladdin found a magic lamp, his luck began to change. Aladdin rubbed the lamp and a magic genie appeared to grant all his wishes. Fine food, fine clothes and jewels, anything he wanted. Now he was rich. He married the princess and ordered the genie to build him a palace. But Aladdin's magic lamp belonged to a wicked magician who ordered the genie to take the palace and the princess away. When Aladdin came home, his palace and his princess were gone, leaving only an old Persian carpet. He could manage without his riches, but he was sad without the princess who he loved. Little Cook Small had to help find the princess, but how would they get there? Small had an idea. He draped the Persian carpet over the wooden spoon and off they both flew until they found the palace. The prince was so happy to find the princess, the princess thought they had travelled on a magic carpet. Little did they know it was really Small's magic wooden spoon. <laughs> Little cook to the rescue once again. That was a great adventure. Oh, that was an amazing adventure. It had so much in it. Way! A beautiful princess and a magic lamp. And a magic flying carpet. Oh dear. 
Oh, I'm so excited about flying on my magic carpet, I can't think what to cook for Aladdin. <laughs> mm. What do you think we should cook? <laughs> oh! Oh. I know! Big Cook's Big Cookery Book! Of course, the Big Cookery Book. There's recipes for everything in there. And where do we look for things to cook? In the book. In the book. In Big Cook's Book. <coughs> Here we are. Oh, I can't believe I didn't think of this myself. Magic Carpet Waffle. Well, hey, Magic Carpet Waffle. The perfect recipe for Aladdin. Come on then, little cook. You read out the ingredients and I'll see if we've got them. OK, let's see. We're going to need strawberries. OK, over to the fridge. Here we are. Oh, yes, lovely red strawberries. My favourite. Got them. Blackberries. In the fridge as well. Nice and fruity. Blackberries, yep. A peach. Peach in the fruit bowl. Here we go. Got it small. Apricot jam. That's in the cupboard, definitely. Apricot jam, yep. Some icing sugar. Icing sugar, here we are. Got that small. And last but certainly not least, waffles. Oh, last but not least, waffles. Great. There we go. Everything we need for the recipe. Waffles are yummy, but I've always wondered how they're made. Well, why don't you whiz off and find out, little cook, and I'll get everything ready. That's a great idea. See you later. Hoo -hoo. Hey, why don't you come along too? Whoosh! Go small, go small, whiz away! I wonder what he'll see today. There's a train! Choo choo! This is the right place. May and her daddy are going to make some waffles. First, they need some flour. Then an egg. May is whisking the eggs. And dad adds some milk. That's another ingredient. Some melted butter. Now the mixture is poured into the mixing bowl with the flour. Maya mixes up the mixture. Mixy, mixy, mixy. Hoo -hoo. That's the waffle making machine. Pour it in. Hee hee. It's all lovely and gooey. The waffle's cooked. You have to wait for it to cool down before you eat it. Yummy! Maya's having syrup on her waffle. This is a special treat. Syrup is very sugary. Mmm, delicious! Bye! Way! I'm back! Oh, hello there, Small. What are you doing, Ben? I'm flying on my magic carpet. Hey! <laughs> That's all very well, Ben, but Aladdin will be waiting for his magic carpet waffle. You're right, little cook. I almost forgot while I was flying on my own magic carpet. Come on, then. Let's go. We're all ready, so take a look. And we will show you how to cook. Jelly boats and pirates go, princess pea pies. 
carrot cakes and fruity smiles. As envelope surprise. We love our cafe and we love to cook. We have a fantastic recipe book. He is big cook and he is small. Friends in our cafe, we cook for them all. When your tummy gets all rumbly, you're ready for a treat. You can make something delicious to eat. Have you cleaned the surfaces? Yes. Have you washed your hands? Yes. All, All clean, clean and, and ready, ready to, to cook. cook. Do you remember the ingredients to magic carpet waffle? You do. There were strawberries. Four. Two chopped, two sliced. Blackberries. Four. Cut in half. A peach. One. Half chopped, the other half cut into thin slices. Apricot jam. Two tablespoons. Some icing sugar. Just a sprinkle. A little sprinkle of magic for a magic carpet waffle. And last but not least, a waffle. Just the one for Aladdin. Let's hope the genie's still in the lamp so he doesn't want one as well. <laughs> Whoopee! Let's get started! The first thing we need to do is turn on the oven to 180 degrees Celsius. Gas mark four. And that's a job for your grown-up helper to do because, remember, the oven is hot, hot, hot. Now, I've also put the waffle onto an oven-proof baking tray. What's next, Ben? Well, this is the fun part, little cook. It's time to decorate the waffle to look like Aladdin's magic flying carpet. Can you remember what it looks like? Oh, yes, Ben. <laughs> huh? Oh, no, I can't, actually. Can you remember, Ben? Hmm. To be honest, Wall, I don't think I can either. But I can remember one thing. Well, what's that? Aladdin's magic carpet looked very much like my magic carpet. Brilliant! I'll go and have a look. <coughs> it has quite a dark and mysterious colour. Oh, right. In that case, we'll put the blackberries on. They're quite a dark colour. <coughs> and it's got a red and orange pattern. Well, we've got red strawberries and orange peaches, so I'll use the fruit to decorate the squares of the waffle. Mmm, that's going to look just like a magic carpet. <laughs> there we go. Does that look right, Small? Nearly. There's still something missing, though. I'll go and have a look. I'm not sure. Come and have a look, Ben. Oh, OK. Aha! Tassels! Tassels! <laughs> we can put those on later. What's next, Ben? Right, we need to put the two tablespoons of apricot jam into a saucepan. Here's the spoon, Ben. Oh, thanks, Small. Hey, can I do the sticky, gooey, jammy, apricotty bit, Ben? In a minute, Small. First, I need to melt the jam in a saucepan over a light heat. And remember, this is a job for your grown-up helper to do because the jam will get hot, hot, hot. Sticky, gooey, jammy jam. When the jam's melted, get your grown-up helper to pour it into a jug. Like this. There we go. And next, here comes a sticky, gooey, jammy, apricotty bit that I think you'll like, Small. Sticky, gooey, jammy, apricotty! <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Small. <laughs> so now I'm going to pour the jam all over the fruit. There. Pour the jam is the new craze. Aladdin's waffle carpet will have a glaze. <laughs> Small's right. The apricot jam glazes the fruit. That means makes it shiny. Pour the jam is the new craze. Aladdin's waffle carpet will have a glaze. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> now the fruit's all glazed with the apricot jam. We can pop it into the oven for five minutes. So, oven gloves on. And over we go. Open the oven. And in it goes. 
And remember, that's a job for your grown-up helper to do because the oven is hot, hot, hot. I'll set the timer for five minutes. Right. I think I'll have another practice on my magic flying carpet whilst Aladdin's magic carpet waffle is cooking. OK, let's go. <sighs> go carpet, go carpet, whiz away! I wonder what we'll see today! <laughs> The magic carpet waffle is cooked and cooled. It looks good enough to fly on, Ben! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Don't forget the tassels! Well remembered, little cook. We can use the slices of peach and strawberry to make the tassels. Mmm! <laughs> magic! And to finish it off, sieve a little icing sugar over the magic carpet. Just like this. And then serve it straight away. So, one magic carpet waffle coming through. There, all done. So what do we do now? Can we play? Not yet. Time to clean and put away. Hooray! Wash, wipe, scrub and clean Make the kitchen sparkle and gleam My name's Ben And my name's Small We've got the cleanest kitchen of all <laughs> Tidy all the bits and bobs The things that help us do our jobs Ingredients we'll put away Ready for use another day Pots and pans will start to smell If we don't wash them really well And now it's clear, let's all smile We'll be finished in a little while Aha! Here comes the plate! Oh, oh, yes! And it looks like Aladdin enjoyed his magic carpet waffle small. Look! He's left a note. Well, what does it say? What does it say? Let's see, shall we? It says, Dear Big Cook Ben and Little Cook Small, My magic carpet waffle was delicious! <laughs> <laughs> to say thank you, I thought you might like to borrow my magic lamp so you can ask the genie for a wish from Aladdin. Wow! Aladdin's lent us his magic lamp. Ho, oh, ho, small. <laughs> what should we wish for? Hmm. Oh, I know, I know. Why don't we wish that your magic carpet can fly? Yeah, brilliant idea, small. Come on, let's go. <sighs> Nothing's happening, small. Ben, remember the story. You have to rub the magic lamp. I am the genie of the lamp and I will grant you one wish. We, we wish this magic carpet would fly. We're flying! See you soon! See you soon! Big cook, little cook, welcome to our cat.